Good day, Diamonds, and welcome to Sisterhood 40s, 50s, and 60s. My name is Shante, and I will be your host for this show. And I first would like to say season's greetings, Happy New Year, and that everyone has a safe and healthy New Year coming up. And thank you for all of your support. And I look forward to seeing everyone who's going to be tuning in and seeing what we're going to be doing with my next guest, who was on my very first interview, Sir Charles Carey. And we would like to talk to him about his new adventure that I will be following. And we hope that you will follow this journey with us well. So I would like to introduce to you once again, Sir Charles Carey, the producer, writer, and singer. Welcome to the show, Charles, and thank you for your time today. Happy New Year. Uh, thanks so much. I really appreciate it. Happy New Year to you and the entire Sisterhood family. Uh, look, it's always great when you can add value, lift spirits up, and do something that's uh, worthwhile and worthy of sharing. So I'm, I'm excited to be here. And let everyone know what projects you're working on, what is coming up, and what we need to see in the future in 2024. Okay. Well, um, I'm putting my speaker hat to the side and pick up my artist hat and producer hat. And what that consists of, uh, I have produced quite a few songs. I've done some collaborations and I have some features on some songs in the R&B slash soul genre. And a couple of my uh, colleagues that are into music heavily and produce and engineer uh, we've gotten together, and uh, I'm going to have a finished product hopefully by, I'll say, March or April of the upcoming season. So the first and second quarter, we should have some nice material for all those who really like old school R&B, maybe with a twist, because we've got a little bit of variety. We've got your straight ahead R&B, mm -hmm. we've got songs with um, like hip hop influences, we've got uh, some pop songs. We've got some club-oriented songs, so it's a good mix of soul, of R&B, and like I say, influences of hip-hop. I'm not a hip-hop artist, I don't rap, mm -hmm. but I know people that do, and they help to make my songs, uh, you know, extend them to a different audience. Right, because we do, in our demographic age, we do miss that type of I love you, romance, baby, I miss you, can't live without you type of music. Yeah. And I'm really excited. I already know what you can do. So we will also put links for information so they can get your music. And this is the type of music I want everybody to know that years ago, you could put the needle on the record or press play and let the whole thing play through. Uh-huh. Yo, sexy. 